4 raised to the power x plus 4 raised to the power x is equal to 16. Find the value of x. So, 4 we can write it as 2 raised to the power 2 then whole raised to the power x plus 2 raised to the power 2 whole raised to the power x is equal to 16 or 16 we can write it as 2 raised to the power 4. Now, when a raised to the power m whole raised to the power n this is equal to a raised to the power m times n and this we can also write it as a raised to the power n whole raised to the power m. So, this we can write 2 raised to the power x whole raised to the power 2 plus 2 raised to the power x whole raised to the power 2 is equal to 2 raised to the power 4. Now, let us consider 2 raised to the power x is equal to a. Then we have a square plus a square is equal to 2 raised to the power 4 or a square plus a square is 2a square is equal to 2 raised to the power 4 or divide both the sides by 2 this 2 and this 2 gets cancelled 2 raised to the power 4 upon 2 means 2 raised to the power 4 minus 1 because a raised to the power m upon a raised to the power n is equal to a raised to the power m minus n or a square is equal to 2 raised to the power 3. To remove the square from the left hand side, we square root it and to balance the equation, we do the same thing on the right hand side also. Remove the square root with this square. So, a is equal to 2 cube, we can write it as 2 square times 2 under square root or this will be 2 square under square root times square root of 2, remove the square root with this square. Therefore, a is equal to 2 times square root of 2. Now, we considered a as 2 raised to the power x. So, 2 raised to the power x is equal to 2 times square root of 2 or 2 raised to the power x is equal to 2 times square root of 2 means 2 is raised to the power of 1 upon 2. Now, there is an identity if a raised to the power m times a raised to the power m, then this is equal to a raised to the power m plus n. Therefore, this will be 2 raised to the power x is equal to 2 raised to the power 1 plus 1 upon 2 or 2 raised to the power x is equal to 2 raised to the power 2 plus 1 upon 2. We took the LCM and added the fractions or 2 raised to the power x is equal to 2 raised to the power 3 upon 2. Now, there is a rule if a raised to the power m is equal to a raised to the power n and a is not equal to 0 or 1, then m is equal to n. That means x is equal to 3 upon 2. So, this is the value of x. We can verify this answer. 4 raised to the power 3 upon 2 plus 4 raised to the power 3 upon 2. We have to check whether it is equal to 16. Now, 4 is equal to 2 raised to the power 2 times 3 upon 2 plus 2 raised to the power 2 times 3 upon 2. Okay. 2 and 2 gets cancelled. 2 raised to the power 3 is 8 plus 8 is equal to 16. LHS is equal to RHS answer is verified. How did you solve the question? Let me know in the comment section. Thanks for watching.